An Iowa teenager convicted of killing high school Spanish teacher was sentenced to life in prison. Wednesday. More than two years after he helped a friend bludgeon the teacher for bad grade. Choose your plan arrow right Jeremy Goodale. 18. Was sentenced to life prison with the possibility of parole in 25 years for his role the November. 2021 of 66-year-old Fairfield High School teacher Noema Graber. Goodale and Willard Miller, both 16 at the time of the killing, pleaded guilty to first-degree charges in April. Prosecutors said Goodale and Miller planned to kill Graber because Miller had failed his Spanish class and his bad grade was keeping him from participating in a study abroad program. Two students followed Graber while he was walking in a park in Fairfield, Iowa, and beat him to death with a stick. After Graber's body was found hidden under a tarp and wheelbarrow, the teens were arrested based on statements Goodale made to friends on social media, which were discovered by police. What I've received can never be replaced, Goodale said in tears during the sentencing. According to the Associated Press, every day wish I could go back and stop myself, prevent this loss and this pain caused everyone. Judge Sean Rains explained the 25 factors he considered before imposing the life sentence. While Judge said Goodale needed significant rehabilitation, Rains noted that the teen showed more remorse and took more responsibility for his actions than Miller and that Goodale agreed to testify against his friend if case went to trial. The judge called Miller, now 18 who was sentenced in July to life in prison with the possibility of parole after 35 years. A much more malicious plot to kill the teacher. It is clear that, unlike your defendant, you regret your role in the of Ms. Graber, Reigns told Goodale. According to the Des Moines Register, the judge added, I guess time will tell, but you're much more likely to succeed than Mr. The sentence was praised by Graber's family who emphasized that teachers had devastated the family over last two years. Family members noted that Graber's husband, Paul, of cancer after his wife was killed. It disturbs me that the last face Noema saw in this world and the last words she heard were Mr. Goodale's. Prosecutor Chauncey Molding told Register he was pleased with the sentence and added that he believed Goodale was remorseful for I believe Jeremy committed one of the most heinous acts we have ever seen in Jefferson County. But that does not mean who he could have become with the right treatment and programming, he said. Noema Graber moved from Mexico to Fairfield, a small Iowa town about 100 miles southeast of Des Moines, in 1992 and earned her teaching certificate. She had been teaching at Fairfield High School since 2012. According to court documents, Miller met with Graber at school on the afternoon of November 2, 2021, and discussed his poor performance in his class. Miller later admitted to authorities.